Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel. And uh, one of the things that uh, we're going to put things straight, because we now know the answers behind all of it. And uh, Microsoft has done a big blog post about it and changes they have brought to Windows 11 24H2. Uh, and specifically with a feature called Recall. So, of course, we all have that Copilot thing that works more or less well, depending on what you do, but um, it's useful for some. And of course, the Copilot list PC on ARM will get recall first. And of course, there's a lot of, uh, of, of recall haters, I will call them out there. Um, I'm not going for the hype of it, uh, of you know people saying, well, you know, they're going to snoop on us with recall and so on. It ain't going to happen. It's not the way it's designed. And of course, uh, just by saying this phrase, a lot of you watching are like, well, you don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, uh, stop the hype of uh, all that crap of, of um, recall uh, snooping on stuff. Recall is actually and will be for some extremely useful. Um, it is a nice feature and even a lot of tech guys uh, and, and tech uh, journalists are uh, agree that you know there are there needs to be guidelines to make sure that everything works fine in, in the confines of our privacy. And Microsoft is addressing all of that and the new update, and that's why Recall got this big delay. But to put things straight of all the fake news that appears in comments on this channel and that I've seen everywhere, uh, first of all, uh, Recall is mandatory and you'll have to use it. You'll have to be there. No, it's not. You will need to approve it to be there. You'll even be able to uninstall it. So that's the first thing that we know is happening. Second of all, all oh, recall is going to be on every PC. They're preparing us for that. No, it's not. Regular standard PCs, x64 PCs that don't have NPUs, do not have the capability of running recall in any way. Recall requires a PC that is really much more powerful, that requires that uh, neural processing unit. So people on 24H2 on standard x64 PCs like I'm using right now, nope. You're not going to get a recall. It's never going to happen on these machines. Um, the ones that will eventually get a recall will have the, the NPUs are the more modern PCs, the ones coming up with uh, you know, the new Intel Ultra uh, Series 2 and even the new AMD uh, AI chips coming out. Those will be the x64 PCs getting recall if you want it. If you don't want it, it won't be there. It is uh, Microsoft really made sure that this is understood because that was one of the first problems recall being there not being un, uh, you know uninstallable not and in, in, in that kind of a lot of people were like well yeah if i don't want it i should be able to remove it so they're answering all of these questions for the rest recall runs and stays on your pc it's not a thing that goes to the cloud or nothing it really really is just on your pc and it is encrypted and anyways whatever you say all the conspiracy terrorists out there are always jumping on. Oh, you don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, right. Um, so anyways, that's the way it is. And no, it's not coming to every PC. And uh, stop believing all the hype of those uh, people that are trying to probably bash more Microsoft and Windows than than, than uh, that they want. And I'm pretty sure a lot of them are, are Linux users trying to say, hey, let's, you know, the worst possible hype on all of this so that people move to Linux, which, by the way, will not happen. Um, I've seen a post today. It's like, oh, there's so much more people on Linux this year. No, there's not. Go look at the real stats. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.